Here's a quick and simple example of how file input and output saving your data to disk. The first thing we do is we declare a variable file name as string. And we have the entire path and some of you have in the past forgotten the actual file name which in this case is file io dot bin so you must have an extension and this bin stands for binary. Here's my main routine and that will call saving the data, loading the data and displaying it. So I, in this example I create an array of a string and I loop around and I prompt the user to enter a name and this will loop around twice and it will read the name into the string. It starts at 0 then it'll go to 1 so I have two names and then it will display the string so it passes the string as a parameter to a subroutine down here that takes the string as an argument. It will save it and load it and display it again console.readline just stops it. So let's look at the saving. Saving I have file open. I pass it number one, the file name, which tells it where to save it, open mode binary, and open access dot write because I'm going to write to the disk. I loop around for i becomes zero to s dot length minus one and I use file put number one and then I pass it the array and then I close. It's very important to close the file afterwards. And I just give myself a message, message saying the file has been written. Now if we look at the load one, with the file open is exactly the same here except for the open access which is read rather than open access which is write. So the code is exactly the same. And once again I loop around in the same fashion but this time I use file get still the number one and I pass it the array here it's file put the number one I pass it the array and then it's file close so there's not an awful lot of difference between this except we're writing here and we're reading here and we're using file put and file get the display is just a simple I pass it the string I loop around and I use a write line to write the name so let's run this code so we run it and I enter name J M. the name is J, the name is M, the file has been written and the file has been read and it will display it again that's after it's been written and read and now we'll end it, we'll close this and that is our code so once again we just create a string we loop around allow the user to enter data into the string we save this data to the to the hard disk using file open and we open it to write file put we pass it the string and then we close the file here we use file open but we open to read we use file get we pass it the array and we close the file simple as that here all we're doing is we're passing it to this one and we're writing it okay so you can practice that one for your file handling, reading and writing to file.